Hi, this is Ding. Uh, we're actually March 9th. I just finished phase two of my training road to London with uh, my trainer Alex Babay. Actually, today we're Friday morning. Well, it was Friday morning. I woke up. I had a great start of my day. Chatted on Facebook with one of my great friends, and I started the day really well. After I had the chance to know that I had a package that came in from Pure Later, so I actually went there, and my full surprise. Thank you, Invacare Canada. I just got my new chair. That's awesome. That's what we see in the box right there. Right now on the TV, right now it's in the States at this very moment. Live, uh, my teammate on Team Canada, Robert Hedges, Bo, as his nickname goes. And uh, he's actually playing for the University of Alabama. And he's playing against University of Whitewater in the semifinals. Right before that game, there was the University of Illinois, the home team that uh, upset at my old university, University of Texas Arlington on the home floor. Uh, that's actually on the TV there, that's actually the court where I actually won uh, my national championship in 2006. So uh, I'll take that chance to give a shout out to all my old teammates, Jay Nelms, Mikey Pay, Dave Gonzalez, Tyler, and uh, Danny, and Ryan, uh, Joe, Comer, Bobby, all of you UTA guys, Texas, that was awesome. Short horns all the way. I'm wearing the, the ring right now just to, just to call all my boys. So um, right now I'm just uh, really happy to be there. Great day. What I'm going to do is I'm going to open my chair, um, the box with my chair. I'm really happy about that. So uh, we're going to do this. I'm really excited to see how it looks. Um, thank you, Invacare Canada. I can't thank you enough again. Really great sponsor. Got it. Uh, so I'm gonna open it up, and uh, we're gonna after I'm gonna compare it with my old chair, and uh, we'll go go from there. All right. So I'm really excited to open this box right here. I've been waiting for this chair for a while. So here we go. See here you actually see my old chair, which is the one on the right, uh, when you're looking at it, and uh, mine, the new ones, uh, the one on the left, uh, you can see the color is really awesome under my new chair. Uh, I didn't want to no paint this time, I just asked it, I want it to be as raw as possible, so you can see it's, a little, it's way more shiny than my old chair with the red wheels and stuff. The measurements are pretty much all the same. Height's the same, length, didn't change nothing in the setups. There's, there are a couple of differences though in my chair. Actually, for the first thing is, if you can look at the foot plate, I got a double, like a really long foot plate, and it comes out, out with a Actually with an angle, you can see it if we go like this, All right? And on my old chair, it was a little short one like that. So that way, I could actually put my feet a little bit more back in my chair, which would cause my center of gravity to be closer to my center. So my pivot should turn, I should be able to turn faster that way and prevent some controversial calls from the refs saying uh, sometimes I put my feet on the ground I won't be able at all even if there's a doubt with that one um, 
What else? The width of the front is, diff is a little bit wider here, just to, to be able to uh, less injuries on my bones on the side of my legs. Uh, we put them a little bit wider than this these ones here. I'm still gonna have to put some padding. I'm gonna have to put some padding like these ones to protect my bones, my knees. And if you can see, actually it's a new material. Uh, so this chair is actually lighter, but and not only lighter, it is also stronger than this type of aluminum chair. So a lot of people are asking me, why don't you like titanium? I don't like titanium chairs because they actually flex and they don't respond as well as aluminum. Uh, the second thing you can see is like the way that they designed it, like on the wing here, you can see there's a, there's a, little, a curve here on this bar here. It's a little bit turned like inwards like this. And the other one on my old chair is just a straight bar. So maybe if I could give you an angle, you could see both, how it's different. Right here, you know, you got a little bend here, bend. Paul Schulte, my, one of my best friends from Texas that actually designed my chair, and it's actually, it's a, a top end Paul Schulte series, um, with all the science behind it and engineering, uh, with the, the dispersion of force actually makes the chair stronger with the way they're curved. There's other places that they're different too, like more on the back. If you can see in the back here, these, these, this, this bar here, in the back here, like just goes up to the, the my fifth or sixth wheel is curved also. And if you look at the last on my old chair, it's just a straight bar right there so there's a couple of differences like that but for dimensions and everything everything's the same uh, I can't wait to try it I'm still gonna have to check a couple of stuff I'm not gonna be able to play with it right now compete I'll be able to go and play with it by myself in the gym but I won't I won't start playing with it first of all I'm gonna have to put a rubber on the bumper I'm gonna go have to go buy one Put one here and um, get some pads here from Denise. And uh, yeah, also, yeah, I forgot there's another system obviously that's changed on this chair is the way they made the, the forks of the little casters. You can see here, you can, they're changeable, they're adaptable. And while my old one were sealed, so. And the foot plate also, if you notice, the foot plate on my my new chair is not adjustable anymore, so there's no play. Like this one here, my old chair, you could adjust the height up and down. But the thing is with my my the power in my legs when I'm pushing the chair, it actually moves a lot. So I have to adjust that bar a lot of times. So that's my new chair. It's really nice. I really like. I'm impressed with the colors. Wow, it's beautiful. It's nice. Um, like the color, like there's no color. I didn't. I didn't ask for paint on it. It's just like raw metal. That's what. I, that's how I wanted it. You can still see the striations of the metal in it, and it's, it makes it look pretty neat. And uh, yeah, so this is the chair right here. I give you like a a better look of just the chair itself. Oh, well, it's moving by itself. See, it's already wanting to go fast by itself. It's ready to move. So yeah, so you got the backrest here, goes up, the protectors. The view from the back, it's actually like this. So, yep. So this is my new chair. Can't wait to try it. Next video, I'm probably gonna film it on court. See how fast this this little speed demon goes. So, all right. Well, this is it for the first day that I get my chair. I'm really excited about trying it, trying it out. I'm probably gonna go shoot some hoops tonight and uh, 
just see how it feels. Uh, I'm really impressed with the color and how good it looks. It's awesome. Um, performance wise, it's going to be awesome. It's, it's light. I can feel it just by lifting it. It looks stronger. I got I to gotta thank my friend Paul Schulte um, from Team USA. I used to train with him when I was at University of Texas Arlington. And uh, he's one of my, became one of my best friends in the world. And you know, like he designs these chairs. It's actually a Paul Schulte series from Top Hen. And uh, so thank you very much, Paul. And work it so that uh, you're willing to work with me to design the best chair and so I could be in my best shape and uh, be able to perform at my highest level. I would like to really thanks again. I cannot say it enough, but Invacare Canada, thank you again. Uh, it's an honor for me to represent uh, Invacare Canada uh, while I'm competing. And uh, I started in my teenage years. I remember the first chair I bought when I was a teenager with my own money. It was a, a, Terminator, a Terminator BB top end. And uh, it's like I'm going to London right now in my prime, in the best shape that I've ever been playing the sport. And having you guys backing me up, it's really an honor and a privilege to be able to, to be sponsored by you guys. Uh, Sorry, I just saw you TA. You guys just lost to Illinois. And I'm sorry about that. Uh, feel bad, but you know, I lost four, four years in a row in the finals before, well, three actually. I won my fourth, fourth year with, uh, with the UTA. So anyways, don't, don't give up. And uh, anyway, so I gotta let you go. So this is a really little video for getting my chair. Can't wait to try it. So uh, I'll talk to you soon and uh, keep uh, keep staying tuned and I'll make try to make more videos on the road to London. So thank you very much.